Hi everybody, Stephanie with Mama Bear Inc. Welcome back to my YouTube channel for another card making video. If this is your first visit, I hope you'll consider subscribing. Today we are going to be making this cute little note card. And um, I know we just got done with Christmas and nobody even wants to think about holidays, but guess what's right around the corner? Yeah. So this is a cute little Valentine, I think, and um, is so simple that it would work fantastic for um, mass producing for maybe your kids uh, to take to school. And it's not so cutesy that it's not good for boys in the class as well. Uh, this stamp set, you're going to think I'm weird. Um, this is one of the first stamp sets that caught my eye in the a catalog, the New Occasions catalog. This is Beetles and Bugs, and I just thought it was so cute. Um, so it was one of the first ones that I ordered, and that's the one that we're going to be using today. We're also going to be using a... Um, a new one from the new annual catalog. Uh, this is Jar of Love, so no, it's not new. Um, but this is Jar of Love. We're going to be using the Love stamp from this set and a tried and true stamp set from, um, you know, way back when. Gorgeous Grunge. Absolutely love it. You have to have it. You can't do without it. It's, it's got to be in your stash. And again, uh, because I am such a big fan, um, oh, I got upside down again. Uh, we are going to be using the Stampin' Up! Note Cards and Envelopes set, and this time in Crumb Cake. These come in Whisper White and Crumb Cake, so we're going to be using the Crumb Cake ones today and making this cute little card. Now, um, this is one I made with one of the bugs, uh, but we're going to be using a different bug today. What bug are we going to use? We're going to use this, this big bug. And you see it has several different, or it has three different pieces. Uh, so we're going to be using some different colors. So let's get started. Um, the first thing that we are going to need is our cardstock. Yeah, let's move you out of the way. We're going to need our cardstock. We need to come out just a little bit. It's just, um, well, we just got closer. That's not going to work. All right. Just, just a little bit. Okay. Are we good? All right. Yeah. So, um, we need our card base. So this is a crumb cake note card. So this is already cut and pre-scored. All you got to do is fold this thing down the middle, give it a good burnish and it's set to go. And we are going to take a layer of watermelon wonder. Um, and this is cut. Oh my goodness. I don't have my notes. Okay, I will have all of the measurements on my blog. Don't worry about a thing. A layer of watermelon wonder, a layer of whisper white. So that's all the cardstock we're going to be using. And let's go ahead and just get started with our stamping um, because this is a really quick card. Um, colors we're going to use today are pool party, watermelon wonder, pear pizzazz, and peekaboo peach. And of course, we're going to use our um, archival black. For the bug body yeah all right getting started first stamp we're going to use is our little love um that's that's going to be our little sentiment on the front and we are going to do it in the watermelon wonder and so i'm just lining my cardstock up here on one of the straight lines on my grid paper and we'll go ahead and get this inked up real well with the Watermelon Wonder. And we're going to put it um, kind, of, kind of up here and sort of try to make sure it's as straight as we can get it. And stamp it down. And there's our little love. So that is on there. Now we're going to stamp our bug. So these are, um, these are actually numbered on the sheet inside, so you can, I don't know if you can see that. Let me bring it up kind of closer. So these are numbered, and they'll sort of tell you what to do first, what to do second. Um, that, well, you know, I have a problem with following directions. So um, I am going to start with basic black and uh, his body outline. Okay, so we'll get him inked up real good, and I'm just going to stamp him down fairly close here. 
He's a big bug. I know they're kind of gross, but I just love these stamps. <laughs> All right, there's our bug. We've done him in black. All right, next color, or the next piece that we're gonna do is his like um, body fill in. And we're gonna do that in pool party today. And if you're wondering where I got my color palette, I cheated, haha, <laughs> like I always do. Um, it's sometimes fun to look at some of our designer paper series packs because they're wonderfully coordinated color-wise. And that's where I took this color palette from. I took it from um, some new designer series paper in our occasions catalog. Um, and it's called, I don't know, it goes with the Tasty Treats. I can't remember what it's called. But th that's where this palette came from. Okay. And so we're gonna, we've got this inked up in Pool Party, and because this, these are see-through photopolymer stamps, we can look right through and stamp down exactly where we want it. And there's our blue body. Ooh, that is cool. I like him. Okay, so we're done with the Pool Party, and we're gonna move on to Pear Pizzazz, and his little, like, spotty, things. I don't know what they are. And I, I, I don't like bugs. <laughs> and they're not my favorite thing. Um, and so it kind of surprised everybody that I loved this stamp set so much. Okay, so where are we? Where are we going to put them? I guess we're just going to put them right here and stamp them down. And there we go. <laughs> so our spotty bug. Okay. I love him. I think he's awesome. <laughs> All right, last thing that we're going to use is Peekaboo Peach, and we're going to use the, the big sp kind of spotty splatter deal from um, Gorgeous Grinch, and we're just going to kind of make him a background sort of random and um, just go around him and fill in your background, just kind of fun, um, you know, you don't... You don't have to be all crazy about it. So, all right, there we go. And that is the extent of our stamping for today. So I, I love the bug. Okay, we are going to take our uh, bug layer and put it on our watermelon wonder. We're just gonna use a little bit of snail for that. And um, my snail and I are not really getting along today. It's very sad when that happens. All right, and we're just left uh, about a, an eighth of an inch border around this. So we're gonna center it up, and then we will put snail on the back of that and put it on our note card. This has a quarter inch border, so it's a little bit bigger. And hey, we're done. This, we've, we've made our card. So, there's our little love bug of Valentine. <laughs> love the bugs. Okay, so like I said, this is in the new Occasions catalog, which I can't find. Okay, here it is. In the new Occasions catalog. Whoa, we need to go wider. We need to come out. So you can see it. Okay, here's the new Occasions catalog. It is live today. I can finally show it to you. The bugs are back here. On page 38, I absolutely love the bugs. But when you look at them in the catalog, they just don't look like much. Um, but I'm here to tell you, this is the cutest set. You can make sweet little valentines with bugs. I just love them. Where'd my other one go? I can't find them. Here it is. Okay, so you can make sweet little valentines with bugs. Um, and again, our note cards and envelope set come 20 to a pack. Uh, for like six dollars. It's like nothing. Um, oh, hey, you know what we didn't do? We didn't put our little enamel shapes on. Ooh, I am just making so much noise. I'm so sorry. Okay, so here are the, the little pool party enamel shapes that I was going to put on here. Um, it's, it's not imperative. It's not a huge deal. I just kind of like them. So, um, and I can't find my pokey tool. Good gracious. I am just having a heck of a time today, and let me tell you, come on, little heart. All right, so these are enamel shapes, and they come by uh, color group. 
So these would be the subtles, I believe. That's what pool party is in. Um, and I'm just using one of the hearts in pool party. And I'm gonna use a big dot. Uh, I'm gonna use a big dot and let's use a littler dot. And yeah, okay, there's our embellishment. So <laughs> these go very, very quickly, as you just saw, can be fantastic for your kids. Your kids can even help you stamp them because they're so simple. So thank you very much for joining me today. I've enjoyed spending time with you and I hope that you'll visit with me again. Uh, take care.